I have always respected every single player that I get to practice with or I get to play against. I, I you know, I understand the the effort and the amount of work and dedication that it's uh, needed in order to to reach a Grand Slam and to win a few rounds, to be to be here competing with the best players in the world. So that's always worthy of respect and uh, and. You know, there's the, yes, there is uh, you know heightened awareness or, or so to say caution when you play someone for the first time because obviously you know they can come out firing and really have nothing to lose and just play the tennis of their lives. But I think also on the other side, uh, I think if you impose yourself from the very beginning on the court, which I have in the first three matches here, you know, then then it makes it hard for them to really believe that they can come back and make a turnaround. In the in the match, um, but it's really nice, I think, overall for tennis to to see new faces, uh, young players. Korda, you know, obviously his father was a champion, and him coming in and 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 you know reaching the fourth round is is a great story. Uh, you know, we I, I feel like we of course you need brands, you want some familiar faces to be out there because that attracts the crowd and interest of people to watch tennis but at the same time it's nice that you know that you know when you have young players coming in making making a statement on, a, on one of the biggest tournaments in the world i think it's it's also very positive for our sport